Oh, boy. Uh, you to tell me about the borders living in our house. It's on my calendar on none of your business things. When you turn our house into a B&B full of bike couriers, it becomes my business. How am I supposed to pay the bills? I need those rental checks to survive. So you can vacation like an 18-year-old? Pretty much. She just came back from Southeast Asia. Hey, what's the vibe? Who is this person following you around? He's my date. Be careful, you're at the edge. And a fabulous one at that. This is it. This is the place we always come when I was a kid, Fairmont Bagel. Every time we came to Montreal, so we can fight in public like a family. It's a bagel shop. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, it's a legendary bagel shop, though. I told you. This is where, well, first of all, this is where Kurt and Carrie would like to fight about whether a whole grain bagel is a real bagel. Oh. And where that New York article that I was reading you about Leonard Cohen. I'm writing a novel oh, oh. based on my life. You're in it, obviously. Oh, send it to me. It'll be good kindling for the fire. Hey, I want to read it. Oh, shut up, Albert. I thought you'd be flattered. Flattered? I don't want all these people reading about me. And writing a novel does not absolve your behavior. You think I have time to buy another pair of socks? No. It's all part of my process, you're OK? Not, you're not even a good writer. Your, your emails will be written by a five-year-old. Yes, no, food, question mark. Is it true you're not singing anymore? Who told you about the renters? Carrie. Of course. Well, she didn't mean to. It just slipped out. I'm surprised she even said anything to me at all. Some water? No. Hey, this is full of Bloody Marys. Then yes. Please. Uh